Bon Crowder with math4.com. Math is not a four letter word. Here talking about congruent triangles and in a minute we'll be talking about similar triangles. So here we have on the Discovery Toys Giant pegboard three congruent triangles. Now congruent means that they're exactly the same size and exactly the same shape. It's not the math definition technically but that is that's what it means for two figures to be congruent. Same size, same shape. For congruent triangles, you can either remember from geometry or you're a geometry teacher or you um, are now learning that three, two triangles are congruent if all three sides are equal. So you can see here that we have one triangle, this teal rubber bandy triangle, has uh, one side that's three units and then the other sides are these angle sort of, um, it's not one unit, it's actually squared to two, but um, so we have this three here, we have a three here, we have this diagonal separation of two, diagonal separation of two, and another diagonal separation of two. So when a kid's looking at this, you can say, okay, look, this is the same as this and this, and there you have your three sides that are the same, so you have a congruent, two congruent triangles. Likewise, the crazy green one over here, uh, the, the fancy rubber bands are used because it's a little easier to see on the video, so pardon the glitter. You'll have three on one side, or you have three on one side, you have this little diagonal of these two, you have this diagonal of these two, just like both of these. So you have three congruent triangles here. The neat thing with the Discovery Toys giant pegboard is that you can um, then modify things easily. So we're going to go uh, and stretch that guy. All of a sudden he's no longer congruent, but it's not hard to do. So I, this, uh, using rubber bands that aren't rubber bands are not so easy. So don't try this at home. I'm a professional. And then I take this one and do that. Do we still have three congruent triangles? Well, you can see I have four, which is actually three units, right? One, two, three. So, but I can count four pegs in between, four pegs in between, four pegs, or four pegs. Then I have this crazy diagonal, might get a little into slope here, right? One and one, two. We go from here, one and one, two, here, one and one, two. And then you've got the same diagonal on these. So you still have three congruent triangles. And you saw by the way I constructed them. And your kids will see by the way you construct them or by the way they construct them that you still have these congruent triangles. So we will do in another video the similar triangles, which are the same, same shape but a different size. So similar triangles, same shape, different size, congruent triangles, same shape, and same size. So this is one way to use the Discovery Toys Giant Pegboard. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you can use it. So this is Bon Crowder with Math4.com, reminding you that math is not a four-letter word.